Be of good cheer, my little ones, for I, Yahushua Mashiach, am the only good shepherd, and I am exposing the evangelical prosperity pims, for the wolves they are. I am beating the wolves away and removing their fangs from your flesh. O oh, my beloved little ones, I speak to those who worship, love, strive to obey and live holy to Abba Yahweh. How you please I, your Yahushua HaMashiach. I am the only good shepherd and the only redeemer of your soul. My sheep and lambs know my voice and like a deer pants for water in the heat of the day. So to my sheep pants for my next word. They know the taste of the living water. As they read my holy scriptures, they drink of my living water daily. You will know the evangelists and pastors, both men and women, who compromise my holy truths and steal my glory. You will know the evangelical prosperity pimps who live in mansions and are millionaires and look down upon the poor and middle class. Yet it is the poor and middle class that have made the evangelical prosperity pimps the millionaires they are today. You can call them the EPPs, for they will be used as your enemies to introduce and lead people to the false Christ, the only begotten son of Satan. Woe be unto those reading this that give finances to the mega churches. I, Yahushua, will hold you accountable where you sow your seed, whether it be in fertile ground with uncompromised truth, where you are nourished, or if it be in barren ground with man-made doctrines, where only the pastors get fat of your tithes and offerings. John Hagee, you are a Judas, a wolf in sheep's clothing, preaching out of both sides of your mouth. You lie to the Jewish people and say, Yahushua did not come to earth to be Israel's Messiah. You tell them Yahushua understands why you do not receive him as Messiah. You set them up to receive the Antichrist as Messiah and have sold them out for silver and gold. For the sake of feeding your greed for fame and fortune, you feed the sheep and lambs some truth mixed with abominational lies. John Hagee, I have released another prophetic message through this prophet and you are doomed. And all those who are in your congregation had better flee while there is yet time. The evangelical prosperity pimps invited the demons of greed and pride and the demon invited the demon of Judas. Those I have named and those I will name have compromised my truth. Instead of lifting up my name, they have lift up their names, putting it on buildings, ministries and churches. The evangelical pimps now love gold and silver more than they love my sheep and lambs. And if they do not repent and turn away from this wicked road they are on, most of those I name in this word will never see heaven. Some had their names in the book of life and their names was blotted out as they betrayed me in heaven so they betrayed me again on earth for the soul already knows where it will go when it leaves this earth now they have a form of godliness but no godliness within evangelists and pastors are supposed to feed my troops and to lead by example these evil ones have compromised twisted my words and conform into their own self-made comfortable image that strive to offend no one. All of these named have proven by their works and thoughts they have lost their fear for Yahweh. They will all quote the scriptures, but all of them have gone astray. Creflo Dollar, I have this against you. You worship the almighty dollar. Paul and Dan Crouch. Joel Alstein, Marilyn Hickey, Joyce Meyer, 
Treflo Dollar, Benny Hinn, Kenneth Copeland, Steve Munsey, Rick Joyner, Pat Robertson, Oral Roberts, Richard and Lindsay Roberts, Juanita Byram, and Thomas Weeks, Paula White, Rodney Howard Brown, Mike Murdoch, Carmen, Billy Graham, T.D. Jakes, Rod Parsley, and Kim Clement. These are just a few examples of evangelical prosperity pimps, and they are pimps for the devil, as they have forsaken their original calling and humble beginnings. Evangelical prosperity pimps have named the ministries and churches after themselves. Joel Osteen, you are lukewarm, and I, Yahweh, vomit you out of my mouth. You preach psychological babble that cannot save anyone's soul. I, Yahushua, have this against you, Joel Osteen. You preach the devil's doctrine of the Antichrist, a new age feel-good religion that leads everyone who believes you to hell. Joel Osteen, where will you hide when it feels like the Astrodrome crashes in on you? You fool yourself, Joel Osteen. You chase away the holy who warn you to repent of your sins and warn you about hell. Just because you deny there is a hell does not mean you will not spend eternity there. And with your wife and children and all your congregation that believe your lies, if you do not repent, just because you refuse to warn about the devil does not mean Satan is not the ruler of your heart and soul. You are exposed and the people reading this will warn others and send this prophecy to all those mentioned in this prophetic word. Holy people flee from these evangelical pumps of prosperity. They deceive people quoting scriptures as if they live them and yet they do not. Be ye holy as I am holy. Strive to live holy in your mind and body and walk in the Holy Spirit more than you walk in the flesh and know that legions of heaven's holy angels fight in your behalf.